A London shop this morning offers a new approach to the war on wrinkles, a new skincare product based on your DNA makeup. Charlie Daggett in London shows us the science of a smoother complexion. And why here? Why on this street? Well, because Bond Street represents luxury in London. And, Professor you know, Christopher I Tumazu know. is a scientist whose expertise runs so anything around. but skin deep, which is ironic given he's recently entered an industry that generally prefers to be taken at face value. He's already a proven inventor who developed an ear implant that helped thousands of children here, as well as an artificial pancreas for diabetics. His latest venture, however, is a beauty store with a difference. U Plus from Gene U is a world first in skincare. By studying DNA, Professor Tumazu says they're able to look at the genes that regulate how quickly a person breaks down the skin protein collagen and their levels of antioxidant protection. Maria is a PhD in uh, clinical science. So she did Inside what looks like a teleporter, I'm shown how to get a good DNA sample. First step is isolate your cells. That cell solution is then squeezed directly onto Tomazu's patented microchip, followed by a questionnaire. How many days a year you're in the sun by means of sunbathing? They ask things like your age, whether you use moisturizer. That chip then goes into a processor. 30 minutes later, the results. This means that genetically you're slightly compromised. Um, I'm genetically compromised. Genetically. You're not the first to say that. Not as bad as it seems. I'm about average. But crucially, the test claims to know the exact levels of my collagen production and antioxidants. And from there, a bespoke serum out of 18 different types on offer is made to suit my skin and DNA. And here is the end result, a serum that's been specifically tailored to my DNA. One for antioxidants, the other for collagen. And there you have it. What do you think? It doesn't come cheap. Roughly a thousand bucks for the test and a two week supply. G News says double blind clinical trials suggested that the treatment reduced fine lines and wrinkles by up to 30% in 12 weeks. The data will be published in the next few months. Manhattan based dermatologist Dr. Elizabeth Hale is looking forward to seeing the results. Yes. We do have technology now that can detect small differences in DNA, but they're taking a big leap because I think they're trying to sell their serums under that assumption that these small differences are clinically significant. I think it may represent the future. I just don't think we're there at this point yet. The data but on one believer is the company's creative director, Nick Rhodes, the keyboardist from Duran Duran. The business idea came out of a chance meeting with Professor Tumazu on a private jet. We chatted away from there, and inevitably the conversation moved around to beauty, which is where we sort of crossed paths. <laughs> Your experience of beauty and his of science, and he thought, oh. Rhodes helped convince Professor Tomazu to take his DNA microchip idea and apply it to the beauty industry. It is a high price point. It's, yeah. Are you not helping rich people just stay pretty? Uh, no, I don't think so. Obviously, the price point at the moment is higher than any of us would like, but it's, um, it's first-generation technology. Rhodes and Tomazu say it's the 30-minute time frame that's the game-changer. Similar DNA tests offered elsewhere can take weeks. And if it proves to be a success over here, they're planning to get under the skin of the American beauty industry soon. Charlie Daggett, CBS News, London. Well, I'd say this, it probably beats plastic surgery. They got to work on the price point. Use your moisturizer, fellas. You're watching CBS this morning.